hello children did you go through the notes which i sent to you i hope you did so so now today we will see what are the different steps through which flowers produce seeds first step is that once the flowers bloom their petals dr get dried and fall off and the flowers turn into small fruits isn't it these small fruits by the time grow into the bigger fruits containing seeds inside them these seeds then give rise to the new plants and this is how we get seeds from the plants isn't it now we will read certain facts about seeds seeds not only give rise to new plants but actually they are good source of food for us also all grains which you can see in your kitchen wheat gram beans peas etc are also examples of seeds itself and if you can observe carefully you will see that they are of different shapes and sizes so we can come to conclusion that seeds can be of different shapes and sizes some can be bigger in size example castor datura mango seed etc some can be small in size too